Today I'm going to talk about how to use the iHealth COVID-19 rapid antigen tests. Each of these boxes contains supplies for two tests. So when you open the box, you'll have two of the test cards. You'll have two specimen collection swabs and then two vials that contain the test liquid. In addition, you'll have instructions that explains all of the uh, directions for how to use the test. So to begin your test, you only need to have one of each of these, so I'm going to set these aside. And to begin the test, what I'm going to do is open up the specimen collection card, and that's what this is. This is the actual testing device. And then you'll also notice a small pack packet of uh, powder to keep the device dry, and you can discard that. To begin the test, open the swab. And like before, it's a regular Q-tip. But what's different about this is that you have to leave it in your nostril for a little bit longer. So the directions are to insert this into your nostril and leave it inside for about 15 seconds. And you'll want to rub the, the specimen collection swab inside your nostril several times. Just until you can feel some resistance. And then you'll want to repeat the same thing on the other side, again for 15 seconds. And after 15 seconds, you're ready to start processing the test. Take the vial and tap it on the table a couple of times to make sure all of the liquid is at the bottom. And then unscrew the orange part of the vial. and then take your specimen swab and submerge it into the liquid. Now you'll want to rub this around a good amount, the directions say about 15 times. And then you'll also want to squeeze the liquid a little bit to make sure that all of the specimen on the swab makes it into the liquid. And once that's done, you can remove the swab and dispose of it. And then you'll want to take the orange cap and put it back on the vial. So it looks like that again. And then to process the test, you'll want to take the white cap off the top. And now it acts as a dropper. And you'll want to have three drops into the collection area of the test card. And like before, you wait 15 minutes to process this test. On the test collection card, you'll notice a C and a T. The C stands for control, and the T stands for test. Like before, you'll want to see a line at the control, at the C area, and that tells you that the test is valid. And then at the T area, if there's a line, that's a positive result. And if it's no line, that means it's a negative result. And again, you'll want to wait 15 minutes before interpreting the results. And that's how you use the iHealth COVID-19 rapid antigen test.